Hello from WP Fraternity. Today we will be seeing the basic configuration of BodyPress user blog, which is a front end editor for the post. So I have uh, downloaded the plugin already, and on this website I am using the BodyBoss theme as it's more compatible with the BodyPress user blog plugin. So if I go to the plugins list. So first let me activate the plugin which is BodyPress user blog. After activating the plugin we will be getting the settings on BodyBoss admin menu and user blog. And this menu can be accessed from the plugin list. From the settings and we can configure or we can come here these settings by clicking that settings as well now here we will be getting few settings for the general settings will be enable user publishing if we marked as checked then the user from the front end can only be draft the post after drafting the post from the front end the admin have to publish the post in order to show that post from the, on the front end and we have to create a page as well create a new post page we have to select the page so there is no page so let me create one add new create new post so let me publish this one we do not need to configure or we do not need to set any of the content here we'll just need to set that page on the generals option now if we see this bookmark page so we have to create a bookmark page as well so let me create another page let me create one more bookmark so i publish the page and now i have to reload this one as i have created the page newly so let me create let me configure the page this one for the bookmark page this is the bookmark page so enable bookmark so if we enable this one that user will be bookmark those post on the from the front end so let me save these settings uh, let me um, go through this all of the settings enable recommended post we can enable this option as well enable auto save this is the very important of uh, important feature or important settings that we can use while using the user blog plugin it's because uh, while writing a post there is a moment that can be uh, can be distracted or we can take some more moment to complete the post so auto save is the more um, realistic option to have so i have enabled this one maximum files per so right now it's okay media management when block is removed permanently delete the associated media file this is the very important and a realistic feature as well so i have enabled this one and let me save the changes first now as we have configured the pages it's good practice to set the permalink just post name just we don't need to anything just save the changes so that it works fine so we have created and let me create some menus as well so that this can be so main menu so create new post bookmark i have okay body panel i have test this okay and header menu this is this is the demonstration of the user block plugin only user block in there so i am not uh, going through other options as well so now here we can see the bookmark create new post if i click the create new post we will be getting this front end post editor so let me go to the lorem epsom so that some content can be founded so 
let me create the post from the front end create new post okay this is a title and let me copy some content paste it here publish okay as i have enabled this option let me go to the option user blog now the we have the option to preview the option this is the post and as we don't have enabled this one the blog has been published if we go to all posters this is the pending if we get a click pending for review publish update now we have this option because if we go to user blog now let me enable this one enable user publishing now admin do not need to publish from the back end the user who will create a post from the front end they can publish their post for from their own let me try this one this is a test to some content content and we can style as well so publish we have published this post now we can bookmark this post as well now if we click on the bookmark we'll see that our bookmark post so this is uh, the basic configuration of the bodypress user blog plugin i hope i was able to show the basic demonstration or basic configuration and lastly i would like to mention one more thing which is exclude categories for that one i need to create the categories first for example right now i don't have any categories so test test two now i have uh, two categories now if i click on the user blog now we can exclude categories as well now while creating a post from the front end the categories can be found from here let me show you again this is a test for categories and featured image paste some content now this is the edit button if i click on the edit this is the categories as from the back end i have excluded the category test the test category is not showing here only the test two and the end categories is showing and we as we do not have any tags right now these tags are not showing here as well now uh, we can set the featured image as well Let so i have uploaded the featured image publish the post now this is the featured image content and this is the categories now if i remove this exclude categories then we will see on the front end that the, all the categories all the available categories are showing for example test test 2 and categories tag and featured image i hope i was able to show the basic demonstration let me know if you have any comment or any of any problem thank you thank you for staying with the wp fraternity